of the challenges that faces dentistry is making people aware of the signs of periodontal disease, gingivitis. It's very difficult, coupled with all of the real factors that come into play, like fear, people tend to ignore their teeth. If somebody had fingernails, cuticles that bled, or any part of their body that started to spontaneously bleed, they would do something about it. It would not be ignored. Yet, people accept the fact that they have bleeding gums and they go along for a very, very long time with sore, bleeding, blue gums and do nothing about it. And I find this really interesting. I say to somebody, if you washed your hands and they started bleeding, you wouldn't just ignore it. Yet, when you brush your teeth and you have bleeding in your mouth, you spit out, you just take that as, oh well, it happens. And of course, inflammation of the gums, bleeding, and all of the signs and symptoms of periodontal problems, be it gingivitis or periodontitis, happen in one of the first things are bleeding gums. Not always, but very often. And I think that people should understand that bleeding gums are not a sign of nothing or of health.